metal wings to fly won't take you to the stars. Use the metal for a boat and you won't sail too far. Stop sitting in the dark, stirring metal pots about. You will change your life forever when you figure out. The secret pink code, pink code, Signs can be tricky, it can overheat your brain. Signs can be hard to chew, each bite can be a pain. Stop sitting in the dark, stirring metal pots about. You will change your life forever when you figure out. The secret pink code. like Crash forgot his mayonnaise sandwich outside again. My mirror! Where is it? Gotta be in here somewhere. Let's land and go take a look. I call dibs on the left side of the island. Oh, no, the right! It's exactly the same, Crash. <sighs> I could have gotten the same tan at home. Why are we here? We're here on a mission. An important one. Grab a shovel. Treasure won't find itself. <sighs> We're not here to find treasure. At least not the kind that's made out of gold. Our treasure will be the knowledge we gain from, uh, science. Sounds good to me! Sounds like gold would still be better. I'm hoping for something even better than gold. For today, our humble group just might discover a new species. Plants are living organisms, members of the kingdom plantae. They include trees, grass, ferns, moss, and a bunch of other kinds that cover our earth. Scientists who study plants are called botanists. And thanks to botanists, we've discovered more than 350,000 types of plant species. But Barry, our home already has trees and stuff. Why do we need another kind? And are you sure it's here? I don't see anything growing. <laughs> this is why I'm the botanist. Our goal is past this cliff, but we're stuck out here. Let's just use Pin's plane thing. <sighs> we can't. There's no visible landing site. Oh, there must be some way to get in. It's important. What about an invisible landing site? No, Crash. I kind of want to get back home today. All right. Huh? If not over, then through. Oh, poor rocks. Good thing we're not geologists. Yeah, I'm awful at shapes. Oh, my. It's beautiful indeed. <laughs> what is wrong with you scientists? <coughs> Disturbing my tanning? I ought to... Huh? Beautiful. You can say that again. It's all untouched for eons. We could be the first to see these ancient species. But how can they survive here? There's no garden or watering them, right? <laughs> Wild plants can do just fine. Nature can survive on its own. They don't need us to help them, even though we need them. Plants are super awesome because they can get all of their necessary food from inorganic substances. That means stuff that isn't alive. All plants need is water, sunlight, and good soil to grow all on their own. If plants
plants are alive, then does that mean they have feelings? Well, not quite. Uh, are you sure they're alive? I mean, they don't speak or walk or, or dance. But they do grow up like we do. Plants are born, live and die. That's life. They may not be able to sing and dance, but they're definitely quietly alive. Like zombies? What is life? People have been asking this question since, well, forever, all over the world. The answer is kind of tricky. See, everything is made up of molecules. Some groups of molecules are not alive or inorganic, while others are alive. So what exactly is the difference? The difference is that living organisms have the ability to reproduce. They make new molecules that look like themselves, and that keeps the species alive. But wait, can't robots make copies of themselves too? Well, that's true, but no matter how advanced your phone is, that doesn't make it alive. So what makes some things alive? What's the difference? The answer is a little thing called proteins. Proteins are molecules that perform a bunch of different jobs within an organism. Take hemoglobin, for example. Their job is to process oxygen. Receptors help us react to senses like smell. Proteins help us to move around. They help us build muscle and even fight off diseases. Thanks for being good at your jobs, little buddies. And all they ask in return is amino acids. We need about 20 different amino acids to keep our proteins working as they should. Animals only make about 11 amino acids by themselves. They get the rest from the food they eat. But plants? Plants are awesome at this being alive thing. They can make all the amino acids they need just from the sun and the water. Which is why it's so good to eat your vegetables. Plants eat the sun? Can we do that? Not quite, Crash. Plants do a lot of things we would never be able to achieve. Also, I have to personally thank plants for their sources of fuel. The technology will be amazing, you know, when we get that far. Ah, boo your technology. Plants give us oxygen. They're the very reason we breathe. That's better than technology, don't you think? You could say that flora are the very lungs of the planet. Wow. I never thought that my potted plants worked so hard. Then I noticed something. There's no bugs. Not one. No caterpillars. Not a single bee. Hey, yeah. I think you're right. Fine by me. This place would be even creepier with a bunch of nasty bugs crawling around. Oof. <laughs> ah! How can this be? No water? Or old age? <clears throat> They're all dried up. I thought you said they didn't need a gardener. Uh, maybe it was no sun or bad soil. If only we had gotten here weeks ago, then we could have helped them all. But we didn't make it. Man, these guys are old. Achoo! 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 like Crash forgot his mayonnaise sandwich outside again. Rosa? Anywhere? Uh -huh. Nope. Mm -mm. Mm. 
Rosa, where'd you go? Rosa! 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 Where are you? Rosa, we're looking for you! Rosa! Rosa! Hello? Rosa! 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 Oh! Look what it is! Save us! We kill her! Something! This overgrown beast ain't Rosa! Get it! You're doing? You scared him! Scared? <laughs> that thing almost ate us all! So you're saying that it's harmless? That's right. I found him some food. Poor thing. He was all alone and hungry. That's a good plan. That's right. You like fish, don't you? Fresh caught fish. Fairy, didn't you say that plants only need sun, soil, and water? Well, see, we're still learning. Sometimes the soil may not be enough. I've heard that some plants can be predators and eat insects. It seems this plant is a pescatarian. Whew! Yeah, it smells like a pest. Maybe it ate all the insects. Good thing we came. Who's a good boy? I need more fish. And so what if he's scary? Plants help us. The least we can do is help them when we can. Holy carrots! Maybe if we help this monster, he'll give us more oxygen or golden seeds or something. Oh, gross. Well. Hey, Barry, looks like we need to go fishing. <laughs>